Welcome to another episode of Fresh Food Facts. My name is Chanel and we're just about to head into the grocery store to learn about finding fresh produce at the grocery store. Let's head in. middle of the winter months when you can't shop at local farmers markets or farm stands for the freshest produce, you can still choose the freshest produce available. But we're not going to start where you may think. We're in the frozen section of the local supermarket. Why are we here? The freshest produce is picked at the peak of ripeness to capture the maximum number of nutrients and fresh produce doesn't have a lot, if any, chemicals. So in most cases, this is why choosing local produce is best, because they don't need to add extras to preserve the food while it is transported or stored for long periods. But there's a trick. With frozen produce, the farmers can pick it at its peak ripeness and then immediately freeze it. This process does not require chemical preservatives. So while you do lose a little of the taste, you're getting the maximum nutritional value without the chemicals. Think of it this way, local farm fresh is best. Then it's a toss up between in season and frozen. Other ways you can eat fresh in the winter is by changing some of your eating habits to eat seasonally. So you might make a salad that doesn't include lettuce and instead add winter fruits like apples, pears, beets, carrots, cabbage, and kale. Add some oil and vinegar with nuts, cheese and dried fruit, and you have an amazing and tasty dish. For more information, check out our Fresh Food Facts episode on seasonal eating. Other great foods that are in season during the winter include turnips, parsnips, carrots, and rutabagas. If you aren't really sure what a rutabaga is, let alone how to cook one, head over to eeriefarmersmarkets.org where we have lots of delicious, budget-friendly recipes for in-season foods all year long. Thanks for joining us. We hope to see you again soon for another Fresh Food Fact. Until then, remember to eat fresh.